I want to talk a little bit now about the piers and most specifically the forms that are used to to create them take a look at this so i'm using this 12 inch diameter top and the base flares out to 18 inches it's called form footer and it's really a unique system it comes as a kit and you just snap it together with no tools it even comes with a reinforcing steel already cut and already bent. That is an enormous time saver if you're a do-it-yourselfer. What you're looking at right here is the actual base, and that's uh, 18 inches in diameter. And then here is a reducing collar that um, transitions from the 18 to the 12. And then the tower is actually two sections that you snap together. And then at the top is a ring that holds it all together, and it has two very important um, oh braces I guess you would call it that hold the reinforcing steel and you'll notice that down in the base the reinforcing steel you know is in a cross pattern once again they're already pre-cut and then these are the two vertical pieces of steel that come up that are already pre-bent but look what it looks like when it's already installed so if you look down you can see that everything is designed to hold the steel and it works really, really well. But this is looking down inside the tube. Very, very neat system. And if you need to go taller, you can continue to add tower sections up from this one. If you need to go down, you know, 54 inches, 6 feet for frost, uh, you can just continue this tower all the way up. Why is this form so much better? I'll tell you why. Here's the alternative. In the old days, you might have to... Uh, you might take one of those cardboard tubes, you know, the, the, this brand name Sauna Tube, and you would have to first pour the pad down in the ground, the concrete, let that get hard, that'll take a day, and then come back and put in your cardboard form on top of the, you know, the wide footer, and then you have to figure out a way to brace it all, and, uh, you know, and, and that just takes all kinds of time. Well, guess what? This particular product allows you to, it, you just have to level the soil at the bottom of the hole, place this 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 form you know into the hole, and make sure it's plumb, and then put a little bit of dirt around the base, and you're ready to pour. I mean, it takes minutes to install it. It's really really an ingenious system. And if you're going to do piers for a shed, for a deck, whatever it might be, you really want to look at this system. Give it a hard look. It's a huge time saver. Just imagine how hard it might be for you to take a hacksaw. And, and cut the reinforcing steel, or you have to go buy it. It all comes delivered to your house, to your doorstep, already cut. Great system. I'm going to show you in the next video what it looks like when one of the, actually when two of these are in place. One of them just set in the hole, and the second one with dirt around it, ready to go, ready to pour. I hope you enjoyed that video and found something helpful and useful. How would you like to get tips like that for free each week in your email box? Sure, it's easy. All you have to do, subscribe to my AskTheBuilder.com newsletter. Look below. See that link? Just click it and you'll be taken to the sign-up form. You're going to get new tool reviews, new product reviews, all sorts of great tips, and the best part, it's free. If you want to discover more home improvement tips, go to AskTheBuilder.com.